Personally, I'm not a huge fan of screen protectors. I've been writing on tablets with digital pens for the last 20 years, and I've grown accustomed to the feel of that plastic pen tip on the glass. I've never done too much damage to my screen in all of those years. Maybe that's because I don't like wearing a watch or any jewelry for that matter. I've seen the occasional light scratch, but nothing serious. And somehow I've never even cracked a tablet screen in 20 years of use. I must be lucky, or I'm doing something right. That said, when I write with my Surface Pro X Pen, which is a really hard plastic pen tip, my handwriting does get messy. That's because the interface between the pen tip and the screen is very slippery compared to a ballpoint pen on a notepad. And I know well that for many people who are writing on the screen for the first time, that it's quite hard to adapt to writing with a pen on glass. With the regular Surface Pro pen, Microsoft softened the pen tips, increasing the friction between the pen and the display, giving it a more paper-like feel. Even so, it feels nothing like pen and paper. So that's where a screen protector like this one that I have here might come in handy. This is an inexpensive screen protector called a paper-like film that I found on Amazon. It's made in Japan. Arigato gozaimashita. This is not to be confused with the popular paper-like branded films that are only available for iPad. Those ones sell for up to three times the price of this one, but the idea is much the same. The screen protector has a matte finish, giving the screen some friction with the pen tip. A nice little byproduct of that approach is that the screen is less reflective too. We've done a separate video sharing some tips about applying screen protectors to your surface, and we'll share a link to that in the video description below. There are some relatively simple instructions on the back of the packaging. If you'd prefer, follow that. There's an alcohol wipe and a screen cleaning cloth for you to prepare the surface of your screen, and there's a squeegee to help you with applying the screen protector, and there's also a sticker to remove dust. This screen protector will fit practically any Surface Pro models from the Surface Pro 3 all the way through to the 7 Plus. It's a tad wide for the Pro X, but if you trimmed off the edges a little before you applied it, you could probably make it work. There are also versions for the Surface Go and Book models. I'll link to them in the description below. I guess the question is, does writing with the Surface Pen on this paper-like film feel like pen and paper? Ah, uh, not exactly. It's certainly better than a hard plastic pen tip on glass directly. There's much more friction here and that automatically slows down the action of your pen, leading to need of writing. So if you're struggling with the feel of the pen on glass, then why not give a screen protector like this one a try? It might also be worth getting a set of alternative pen tips for your Surface Pro pen. For the current Surface Pro pen model, you can buy a pack of three tips, ranging in hardness. The middle HB tip in the pack is the one that was actually included with your Surface Pen. So there's a softer tip labelled B and a harder tip labelled 2H. Try them out in combination with this screen protector so you can find a feel that's right for you. I'd expect that a plastic screen protector like this one would last somewhere between 6 and 12 months, depending on how much you use it. So remember to replace it when it starts to look a little tired. If using a pen on glass is new to you, Another thing to bear in mind is that it will not feel natural for a little while. Things only feel natural once you've practiced them to the point of unconscious competence. So don't give up. And keep in mind the important benefits that writing with a digital pen brings. If you're wondering what that means, check out our series on the science behind the Surface Pen, and we'll link to that in the description below. So if you want to know more about how to be productive with your Surface device, Subscribe to this channel and hit that bell so that you get notified about our video next Wednesday. So there's a softer tip labeled B and a harder tip labeled HB. BH. B. What is it labeled? <laughs>